Alright, so welcome back to another episode of Topio, Tokyo, and I figured I had to say this word, Zanadu. I was close with Zandu, no, it's Zanadu, I was missing an A. And, uh, yeah, so I'm pretty sure, um, what we wanted to do last episode, why am I, ah, that's why, we wanted to go to quests and do the quests. One's required, one's not. We'll do the not required first. I dropped my precious, precious wallet somewhere and now I can't find it. I'm in the first floor. Someone please help. Okay. So, do I just gotta go to the first floor hallway now? Fetch a special pick-me-up. What am I, an errand boy? Well, I guess it won't hurt to help her out. Speaking of which, seems like the student who posted the other quest could use a hand too. I'll check it out if I have time. About quests. The forum on the Nair. Sometimes it's requests or questions from people who post on there. These kinds of posts will be logged as quests on your Nair question tab, mainly during your free time. Aside from quests mark required, you are free to accept the or ignore requests. Some may re expire if you progress the story, however, so be careful. Depending on the timing, there are some hidden quests that are not registered on the Nair. Oh. So, there's some with hidden. That's lovely to know. You said the first floor, so I'll take a look around for a chick infirmary. God, I don't know where I'm looking. Oh, found her. So you're the one that dropped the wallet? Oh no, my wallet. Where'd my precious wallet go? Ah, are you Nodoka? What did you want? I am Nodoka, but who might you be? I am Tokisaka from Class 2B. I saw your pass on the Nair, so I came to check on you. Oh, really? A, a guy came? I guess I can't be picky, though. Something the matter? N nothing, nothing at all. Ahem, so, since you're here, are you going to help me find my wallet? That's what I came here for. Really? Are you sure you don't, you know, have other things to do? Well, I just feel bad leaving you like this, so it's a problem. Do you have any idea where you might have left it? Not a clue. By the time I returned to home, it was already gone from my pocket, but I'm positive I had it with me until lunchtime. Mm, okay, so it's been a little while already. Do you remember where you had lunch? Mm, the roof? I ate lunch on the roof today. I was just relaxing, and then the bell rang. I had to run down the stairs to make it back in time. The roof, huh? Seems like a likely spot. The wallet has something inside that's very important to me. I'm sorry for the trouble, but I really appreciate the help. No worries, you can count on me. Let's split up and see if we can't track it down. <coughs> Well, if the roof is likely where it is, let's go check the roof first. You had lunch up here. Um, Mario Academy, don't lose or something. What the heck was it? Do it again. Okay. Um, that damn teacher is minding a business, whatever. I just have a big heart. <laughs> Though they could be a demon in middle school, I'm not scared. Other bullshit. Oh, I think I just found her wallet. How the fuck would it get here? What an odd spot if, you're, if she was having her lunch there. Yep, it's definitely hers. She must have been eating lunch up here and dropped it on the bell rang or something. Glad I found it. Hmm, there's something else here. A piece of paper? No, it's a photo. Did it fall out of the wallet? This picture. Return the wallet to Nudica. Uh, I'm so glad to have it back, my sweet, my precious. And there isn't even a scratch in my darling's picture. Oh, so that's why it was important for you to get it back. A picture of Mitsuki Okuto, a third year, and our student council president. It almost seems like that thing is worth more to you than the wallet. Well, of course it is. This is the precious picture of my dearest Mitsuki. Oh, we're together again, my darling. Not creepy. Me at all. Um, so are you two friends something? Not at all. We've only said hi to each other in the hallway. But one day, one day I will join the student council. And on that glorious day, Mitsuki and I will be forever sworn sisters. Forever. Alrighty then. I guess she's just really into her. Really, really into her. Thank you so much. We might never reunite it if we're few. I thought members just mere objects until now, but your services may reconsider that view ever so slightly. Happy to help, I think. Just call me an object. I don't know how I feel about her now. 200 gems, and my virtue increased. Looks like I completed the request. Hey, what's this gem? Not sure, but I can go Cool. 
so now it said some missions are actually hidden depending on the timing of the story there's probably none around right now though we'll just leave the school for now I don't think there's anything major enough that we would need to do it here anyway I'm not kidding you I don't know what's going on but I'm not kidding you my iPhone clock is off so it could be like to my lesson who are you? isn't that Kogayama? Ryota said she was a fan or something. I think she's in some idol group. Uh oh. She dropped a thing. Hmm. This is her. Oh, what a pain. Because now we gotta go after her and return it because we're just a gentleman. Hey! You dropped this. Hand it over the cart. That's my agency card. Who the heck did I lose that? Just a sec ago. Is it important or something? Yeah, it's the ID card for my agency in Akasaka. Phew, my manager would have never let me in. Well, let me hear the end of it if I lost this thing. Oh, a new character. Rion Kugayama. Hopefully I pronounced that right. Lucky, thanks for saving my bacon. Um, what's your name anyway? I'll give you an autograph as thanks. I'll even sign it with a kiss if you like. If you want. Doesn't fucking really matter. Yeah. Pass. See you later. Make sure you don't lose it again. Hmm? Hold it right there. What do you mean, pass? I'm an up and coming member of. Leon. That's my autograph. You're turning your nose up, Pat. Oh, yeah? That's what your group's called? I think I've heard of it mentioned but once or twice recently. You think you've heard it mentioned once or twice? Sorry, I don't know really my thing. My friend's a fan, so I've heard some stuff about it. But I can't say I know any of your songs. Right to the heart, she is gonna be so mad. Oh, oh fuck, she even fell over. I can't believe we should the same school with a guy like this. You better believe it. No, it just means that we haven't done enough. I have to work harder to pass on my autograph, huh? Well, I'll show you. Hope you do. Well, you alright there? Didn't you say you were gonna be late? Oh, you're right. I've got to get to my agency. But first, what's your name? I already said I don't want your autograph. Just give me your name. Tokisaka. Who Tokisaka of Class 2B? Tokisaka. Got it. I'll remember that. Here. Sure. This is Speaker Single that just came out. Listen to it. You won't regret it. Yes, I will. You see, because real life, for me, I'm a metalhead. I, idol music is not gonna be up my alley. Not even close. Jeez, that girl's got way too much energy. I thought idols were supposed to be stuck up or something. She seemed pretty normal to me. Whatever, I should head to town. My job at the shopping street, um, manning the sports equipment store. I'll head on over after I take care of Yukino's request. Woo, Moriyama City is now available. Complete the West caffeinating my third eye and then head to the sports equipment store at the shopping street to progress the main story. Offended you shared some bananas. Regarding offended you shared some friendship episodes. During free time periods, you can complete quests and friendship episodes for some of your friends or sub characters. By using Affinity Shards, you can view certain events and also deepen your friendships with that character. Once free time is over, however, friendship episodes will disappear like quests, so be careful. So I take it. Oh. It's like you can only use so many at a time. Yeah. So I can only deep in friendships with so many people at a time. So I can definitely go deep in some stuff right now. Like, I got two, and there's three options. Love it. Well, I'm sure there'll be more chance for him. Let's go deep in with him and with one of the females. When you're on a shopping street, this place never changes. I still have time to kill into my shift so I can wander around for a bit. Damn. Now we just gotta find my dude. So I'll fashion shopping arcade this amazing stuff. But it right now, busier candy store, sports stuff. <sighs> oh, I can upgrade equipment here. That looks like my buddy, my pal. The friend Ryuta. Welcome, we got some awesome sales. Hey Koo, should you beat your part-time job right now? I still have a little time left. 
Things look pretty busy today. Yeah, once at the end of the month hits, we usually get a bunch of stuff to do. I have to put up next month's flyers later. I just want to get it done so I can chill in the back. Putting up flyers make it faster if there's two of us. Let's chill with them. Let's use one of my crystals on this guy. Is there anything I can do to help since I'm here? Really? What about your part-time job? If it's only flyers, we can split them and fish in no time. Let me know when you're ready to go. Oh yeah, hold on a minute, okay? Oh, I'm doing work before work. Once Ryuta finishes his work at the store, I help him put up flyers. Lovely. Alright, let's do this. Do you have flyers, Koo? Yeah. We just have to post these in front of all the stores, right? I'll go to the west side, you take the east side. Let's have a race to see who can finish putting up the flyers first. Say, so please don't actually make me do this as like a mini game. I'd be pissed. This music is kind of jamming. Well, it seems like he's going to win, honestly. What are you done? Oh, I think he just kicked our ass. Or is it a tie? Yeah, it looks like I won by a hair. Oh, for the love of... You better not have half-assed anything. Eh, of course not. They would admit defeat like a man. Yeah, jeez. But really, thanks. We finished things up much faster than I thought I would. No worries. It's not the first time I've helped you out. And despite the handmade vibe, the design is really impressive. I heard you have a hand in design. Yeah, I'm like the pep squad leader from Moriyama Shopping Street. You need to get a hold of potential customers' heartstrings by any means possible. <sighs> it's like the only time you're serious is when Shopping Street is involved. They're usually pretty... Let me just uh, try this here. Last is fair about things? What the fuck is that? Yeah, I'm always serious. How do I explain it? I really like the Shopping Street vibe. It's almost like time doesn't exist here. It's old and run down, but that's exactly why I wanted to keep it that- Well, keep it the way it is. Shopping Street is my home after all. Ryota. Oh, please, spare us the BS posturing. That was rude. Who the fuck are you? Oh, it's you. That's Ryota's childhood friend. Hi, Shizuru. Uh, hello, Takasaka. And you? What's with the pose, idiot? Uh, as someone who claims to be the protector of Shopping Street, you call this job well done? Oh, it's upside down. I knew you half-assed things. Stupid me. And I brought to you some sweets as a token of my appreciation, too. And heard you're, you're refusing to help out the store because of some stupid idol concert. You've been skipping kendo practice, too. If you keep screwing up like this, your future will go, too. Alright, alright. Stop lecturing me, Mom. <clears throat> Damn it! In here, I thought I did something pretty cool for once. You two are never going to change, are you? But what's that supposed to mean? Hey, are you two listening to me? Which just are you? Besides, you're always... <clears throat> oh, losing my voice to sleep, but... I took the time to enjoy the snacks you were brought. Well, she continued to lay into Ryota. Well, as Ryota rung out physically and mentally, we returned to his family's grocery store. Your bond grew stronger. Whatever the fuck it actually does. Let's go to area... Which female do I hang out with? The childhood friend or the one that actually fights with me? Do we pull it just the first one I find? No. If we're pulling that, we found her. I'll do this one. We'll. We'll, uh. We'll catch up with the other one after. She, I feel, is gonna be more important. As of now, there's no issues at the target location. Looks like we're going to have to do some legwork to learn anything. Let's return to the base for now. Hey, doggy. I lost track of her on campus, but I didn't expect to find her here. I still have a bunch of stuff I want to ask her, and even more I want to say. But should I talk to her before she disappears again? Let's give her her last stone and hang out with her. Hey, hey, doggy. Oh, Tokisaka. What a coincidence. I didn't expect to see you here. Yeah, thanks to a certain somebody avoiding me, it's been a while since we talked. But now that you're here, maybe you have some time to... I'm sorry. I have to go somewhere. See you tomorrow. Hey, let me finish. Say so what a hangout time we just had. Just... just ooh! Hey, hey doggy, I... Wait up! Damn it, I said wait. Saka, I can occasionally appreciate your forceful demeanor, 
But seriously, you need to pay attention to where you are before one of your little outbursts. Huh? Oh dear, are, are our two lovebirds having an argument? Ah, to be young and in love. You can fuck off. S sorry. Yeah, whatever. Tokisaka, we're in the same class. Nothing more. No matter how much you badger me, I'm not giving you any answers about that night. I've told you this a million times, yes? Yeah, you have. But it doesn't mean I'm not going to ask again. More importantly, though, I realized that I didn't thank you then. Huh? If it wasn't for your help, Shuri and I would have been screwed. So thanks, Hiragi. Oh. Don't mention it. But seriously, did you follow me all this way just to say that? You really are strange. Sorry if you think I was stalking you or anything. That's all I wanted to say. See you later. Oh. She seemed actually disappointed afterwards. Tokisaka? I stand by everything I said, so don't expect anything regarding the matter to change. But if something like before happens around you again, if I don't see you at school, come see me at this cafe. This cafe? The one that says cafe. I can figure that out. Any particular reason for coming here? Or is it just because you like the place? It's where I live, more or less. I'm regularly here, but if you leave a message with the owner, he'll make sure it gets to me. Oh, and on an unrelated note, they have really good coffee here. Oh, really? Alright, I'll swing by here if anything else happens. Good, one more thing. Don't try to deal with any of this on your own. Goodbye. I wouldn't try on my own anyway. Not with this guy. A cafe in Brick Alley. I didn't know she was commuting from here. I have a bunch of other questions for her, but I think I'll leave them for another day. I should get going. that be, my dude. Your bond with Asuka got stronger. Lovely. Well, I just did a quick pause thing to check the time and what I had recorded. We have a little bit of time left, so... I'd say we can... go finish up. Now, if I go and find her and try to talk to her... We probably can't hang out with her, right? I just want to test it. Wherever Shiori is. She must be in a store or something. So I... Didn't really spot her. I know it says I gotta go there. All in her... We should probably just start discovering some of these areas anyway. If you need to contact me whenever you need to. As class president, I am open to the occasional personal consultation. Alright. What the heck do you sell here? Xiphone cleaner. Mini light. Oh, it actually puts stuff up. Not bad. Him. I don't think it did anything. I'll put one on her too. And we get color red. Actually, you know what? We'll buy one of each of these too. Might as, might as well, I guess. Boost our stuff up a little bit. Okay. Well. You know what? I'll do lottery later. Because I don't really know what uh, we're going to get out of that. Oh, she was in here. Well, I'm still going to go check it out. You can purchase books. The books are Ryan. Go to the camp menu item. Use it. Da, 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 da. Events. Some books have a great deal of content. Awesome. They probably do something for me as well. Oh, haiku, good to see you. Get any requests, part time job today. I made up sorry if they actually has to look at anything's fine, really. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I can't hang out with it. But I could have, but I used up my time. But I used it how I wanted.
this is my mission? With Mizuhara? Excuse me, I was told to come here by Yukino. I take it you're the pharmacist, Mizuhara? That's right. And you must be Tokisaka. I've heard about you from her. Ah, that will make things easier. Can I get that eye opener then? I was just about to make it right now. I take it Yukino didn't fill you in on the details. What do you mean? Well, getting the dosage right takes a bit of time. She said you'd be happy to help me with a few things while I was getting everything together. I didn't hear about that. She normally sends all sets of odd jobs for me, but doesn't tell me anything except where to go. I see. It seems you've had to deal with quite a bit. Well, I'm pretty much used to it. So, what am I supposed to do? Ha <laughs> glad you're on board. Well, I need to confirm something with you first. Do you remember how you went into the eclipse the other day? How do you... Where? Who are you? No need for the hostility. Hiragi has told me a great deal about you as well. Like her, I'm definitely against involving civilians in the fight against the Eclipse, but at the very least I'm willing to provide some small amount of assistance. In that case, can you tell me more? How does that world even exist? And when did Hidalgi become involved? Unfortunately, answering those questions goes far beyond what I'm willing and allowed to volunteer. Besides, I merely support personnel. I'm affiliated with the parent company that owns this particular pharmacy chain, so I don't know how much about her circumstances. I see. I guess it'd be pointless to ask any more questions. But seriously, what in the hell is going on here? I fully understand your confusion, but you really need to take a deep breath and calm down. To continue as a pharmacist who knows the Eclipse, I am tasked with making medicines useful there. It is my duty to help you should anything happen to you while you are there. Thanks. Speaking of the Eclipse, I see that you have a few gems on you right now. To clarify, gems are those crystals that you find after defeating greeds. Oh, those transparent rock things I keep picking up. Yeah, I have a few. Do you care? All right. Now about my request. Exchange your gems for yen with me. Gems and a yen. Exactly. Why not cash in a few of them right now? Okay. I'll do that. You can now buy Eclipse Medicines and exchange gems. Ed sec at a pharmacy. Talk to Mr. Hara and buy and go to the exchange to exchange gems for yen. All right. Their only purpose is to be converted into money. James Pickett, so that is their only purpose? I have no quarrels with that then. Yeah. Woo! And that's where I can get this stuff. I get it. Well. Got a couple of those. And then a handful of those. Was that it? Is that the mission? All right, our transaction is complete. Are you really okay with giving me money for this stuff? Uh -huh. Think of it as a mutually beneficial exchange. The gems are definitely not precious stones, but they do emit an energy unique to the Eclipse. Those of us involved with the Underworld know how useful that energy can be. The Underworld. On a related note, you can also manage gems on your iPhone like electronic currency. I know you'll be picking them up here and there, so remember that. What? Then again, the last time I completed an air request, I got something pretty cool in return. Now then, I have two more favors to ask of you if it's alright. Well, there are more errands than favors. Fat Sacco Cash, Eclipse Raw Materials. I get the money, but what is Eclipse Materials dropped by defeated Greeks? Eclipse Materials. Here's the gist of the errands I need you to run. Take the money to the Star Camera next door, and the materials to Kagu Ya. to Kugu Raya in the shopping street. Be sure to mention my name so they know what's going on. I'm counting on you. Sh sure. Might as well get moving. Ugh. I love being an errand boy. So much. Just, oh, It is the best. We'll probably finish up this mission and call it a... Call it a day for the episode. At least that's what I'm feeling. About Gramps. Despite what he said, Grandfather is pretty happy you came to visit. Cool. Be sure to visit more often. Sure will. Gotta visit Gramps. Look, with a star cam, you have some trouble with something. Say everything okay. Well, I'm here to drop off some money from a friend, Mizuhara. I see, you must be Tokisaka. I am Akane. I'm normally not allowed to mention the fact, but I deal with the Eclipse-related services. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. 
Eclipse-related services. I thought Star Camera was a national chain. What in the hell is going on here? I suppose it's only natural that you're surprised. I was assigned this particular Star Camera store by another organization, though my position and responsibilities are far different from Mizuhara's. I am the only one here aware of their current situation. I'd appreciate your discretion in this matter. But of course. Holy crap, but I do feel a little better about things now. First Mizuhara and now her? Why is everyone coming to Moriyama of all places? I think you should do it for now. Well, we, that should do it for Nurkin, I guess. Now, if you'll hand over the envelope. Sure. Here you go. I'll confirm that I've received payment. Here you go. This is the element sold at the store. What is this? I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. However, when you need to have... Oh, when you have time, I'd like to explain the services offered at this particular counter. Uh-huh. Whatever. Next stop. Go, go, go. Or whatever the fuck the name is. At the, uh... Moriyama. Well, uh, 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 you're right here. Ah, oh, you're the blacksmith. Okay, you're not what I expected for a blacksmith. You can't be the blacksmith, you're just gonna be. Look, to blacksmith Kugu Raya. Do you need something fixed today? Actually, no. I've rarely ever come to the store. But the only stubborn old man worked here. When did this gra his granddaughter start helping out? That's the granddaughter. Um, excuse me. Oh, sorry. I'm here to drop something off from someone called Mizuhara. Oh, and you must be Tokisaka. Let me get my grandfather for you. She's sure. What the hell? Is this kid about the Eclipse too? I think everyone does but us. You got an eye patch. You a war, war guy? Gotta be. I've seen you before. You're the one who can't even control his own damn weapon. Weapon? Oh, you mean my soul device. Do you even know what that is? Uh, whatever I do or not. Oh, whether I do or not. I'm sure as hell not going to tell me telling you. Damn, is this going to happen to me everywhere I go? First lesson, know thyself. If you're going to learn anything, you need to start there. Know thyself. What in the hell does he want from me anyway? Putting that aside for now, I think you have something from Mizuhara for me. Yeah, here you go. Okay, we get the raw materials. Hmm, I'd better get started. Mayu, make sure you pay attention. Yes, grandfather. Making something. Is it for me? Can it be for me? Here, take this with you. It's an element made from the material you brought me earlier. How do you make the perfect orb out of all that? His skills are truly amazing. I hope to be able to do that someday. Don't run before you can walk. I thought I told you that already. Yes, sorry. Damn, Jihai. Is oh, just as ruthless as his own granddaughter. But just as ruthless too. Either way, this completes the job. And don't come back until you learn how to control your weapon. Okay. Control my weapon. I don't even know how the damn thing is supposed to work. Whatever. At least I'm finally done with this errand. I should go back and talk to Mizuhara. Fuck, I didn't even have to go back myself. So. Oh, I take it you finished this errand I sent you on. Good timing. I just completed that pick-me-up. Let me give it to you now, before I forget. Canned Fury. All this for a drink? I thought it'd be more medicine-y like pills or something. You could have wanted something that was easy to get down. It's a very special blend of herbs and whatnot, but it's not much different from coffee or energy drinks. Haha, <laughs> I see. Oh yeah, here's the stuff I'm guessing you wanted. Seems like they're both elements. Bingo! But why don't you just keep them for yourself? I'm pretty sure you'll find them useful. Really? I don't even know what this stuff is, but I'm guessing these errands were for my benefit. I did say I was willing to provide some small amount of assistance, didn't I? Oh right, you can also exchange gems at Star Camera and Kagaguria as well as here. But for now, please deliver that to Yukino. Sure, got it. How much is Yukino know about what happened today? I should ask you when I give this to her. And we will give it to her, but we'll give it to her in the next episode. So please comment, like, and subscribe to what you thought of the episode. And I'll see you all in the next one, guys. Take care until then. Buh bye bye